Welcome to our Bible Geography Quiz. Have you ever wondered about the places mentioned in the Bible and their significance to the stories we know and love and the stories that encourage us? Well, you're in the right place. In this quiz, we'll test your knowledge of biblical geography with 30 intriguing questions. Get ready to embark on a journey through the lands of the Old and New Testaments as we explore the rich tapestry of biblical history together. Let's dive in. Question 1. Where was Jesus born? A. Bethlehem. B. Jerusalem. C. Nazareth. D. Jericho. The answer is A. Bethlehem. Luke 2 verse 4 to 7. Question 2. In which city was Jesus crucified? A. Bethlehem B. Rome C. Jerusalem D. Jericho The answer is C. Jerusalem. Jesus was crucified at a place outside of Jerusalem called Golgotha, which in Aramaic means place of the skull. The Latin word for skull is Calvaria, and in English, Christians refer to the site of Christ's crucifixion as Calvary. Matthew 27, verse 33. Question 3. What is the name of the mountain where Moses received the Ten Commandments? A. Mount Zion. B. Mount Hermon. C. Mount Sinai. D. Mount Carmel. The answer is C. Mount Sinai. Then the Lord came down upon Mount Sinai, on the top of the mountain. And the Lord called Moses to the top of the mountain, and Moses went up. Exodus 19 verse 20 Question 4. In which city was Paul converted to Christianity? A. Damascus B. Athens C. Rome D. Jerusalem The answer is A. Damascus. Then Saul, still breathing threats and murder against the disciples of the Lord, went to the high priest and asked letters from him to the synagogues of Damascus, so that if he found any who were of the way, whether men or women, he might bring them bound to Jerusalem. Acts 9 verse 1 to 22. Question 5. Where did the Israelites cross the Jordan River to enter the Promised Land? A. Jericho B. Nazareth C. Bethsaida D. Gilgal The answer is D. Gilgal. Now the people came up from the Jordan on the tenth day of the first month, and they camped in Gilgal on the east border of Jericho. Joshua 4 verse 19 Question 6 what is the capital city of Israel during the reign of King David? A. Jerusalem B. Samaria C. Hebron D. Bethlehem The answer is A. Jerusalem Then David dwelt in the stronghold and called it the city of David. And David built all around from the millow and inlet. So David went on and became great, and the Lord God of hosts was with him. 2 Samuel 5 verse 9 to 10 Question 7 Where did Jonah try to flee to when he disobeyed God's command? A. Tarshish P. Nineveh C. Joppa D. Tarsus The answer is A. Tarshish now the word of the Lord came to Jonah the son of Amittai, saying, Arise, go to Nineveh, that great city, and cry out against it, for their wickedness has come up before me. But Jonah rose to flee to Tarshish from the presence of the Lord. He went down to Joppa and found a ship going to Tarshish. So he paid the fare and went down into it to go with them to Tarshish from the presence of the Lord. Jonah 1 verse 1 to 3 Question 8 What is the city of David's birth? A. Bethlehem B. 
Jerusalem. C. Nazareth. D. Jericho. The answer is A. Bethlehem. Now David was the son of that Ephratite of Bethlehem Judah, whose name was Jesse, and who had eight sons. And the man was old, advanced in years, in the days of Saul. 1 Samuel 17 verse 12 Question 9 In which city did David fight Goliath? A. Bethlehem B. Jerusalem C. Nazareth D. Elah The answer is D. Elah. Now the Philistines gathered their armies together to battle, and were gathered at Sacho, which belongs to Judah. They encamped between Sacho and Ezekah and Ephes Damon. And Saul and the men of Israel were gathered together, and they encamped in the valley of Elah, and drew up in battle array against the Philistines. 1 Samuel 17, verse 1 to 58. Question 10. Where did Elijah confront the prophets of Baal? A. Mount Carmel. B. Mount Sinai. C. Mount Moriah. D. Mount Hermon. The answer is A. Mount Carmel. Then it happened, when Ahab saw Elijah, that Ahab said to him, Is that you, O troubler of Israel? And he answered, I have not troubled Israel, but you and your father's house have, and that you have forsaken the commandments of the Lord and have followed the balls. 1 Kings 18 verse 17 to 46. Question 11. What city did Abraham leave when God called him to the promised land? A or B, Babylon. C, Jerusalem. D, Nineveh. The answer is A, or, now the Lord had said to Abram, get out of your country, from your family, and from your father's house, to a land that I will show you. I will make you a great nation. I will bless you and make your name great, and you shall be a blessing. I will bless those who bless you, and I will curse him who curses you, and in you all the families of the earth shall be blessed. So Abram departed as the Lord had spoken to him, and Lot went with him. And Abram was seventy-five years old when he departed from Haran. Genesis 12, 1-4, question 12. Where was the city of Sodom located? A. Near the Dead Sea. B. Near the Sea of Galilee. C. Near the Jordan River. D. Near the Mediterranean Sea. The answer is A. Near the Dead Sea. Now the two angels came to Sodom in the evening, and Lot was sitting in the gate of Sodom. When Lot saw them, he rose to meet them, and he bowed himself with his face toward the ground. Genesis 19 verse 1 to 29. Question 13. Where did Moses die before entering the Promised Land? A. Mount Nebo. B. Mount Sinai. C. Mount Horeb. D. Mount Zion. The answer is A. Mount Nebo. Then Moses went up from the plains of Moab to Mount Nebo, to the top of Pisgah, which is across from Jericho. And the Lord showed him all the land of Gilead as far as Dan, all Naphtali, and the land of Ephraim and Manasseh all the land of Judah as far as the western sea, the south, and the plain of the valley of Jericho, the city of palm trees, as far as Zoar. Deuteronomy 34. Question 14. What city did Joshua and the Israelites conquer after crossing the Jordan River? A. Jerusalem. B. Jericho. C. Bethlehem. D. Nazareth. The answer is B, Jericho. Now Jericho was securely shut up because of the children of Israel. None went out, and none came in. And the Lord said to Joshua, See, 
I have given Jericho into your hand, its king and the mighty men of valor. You shall march around the city, all you men of war. You shall go all around the city once. This you shall do six days. Joshua 6, question 15. Where was the tabernacle located during the time of the Israelites wandering in the wilderness? A. Bethel. B. Jerusalem. C. Shiloh. D. Hebron. The answer is C. Shiloh. Now the whole congregation of the children of Israel assembled together at Shiloh and set up the tabernacle of meeting there. And the land was subdued before them. Joshua 18, 1. Question 16. What city did David reign over as king before Jerusalem? A. Hebron. P. Bethlehem. C. Nazareth. D. Jericho. The answer is A. Hebron. It happened after this that David inquired of the Lord, saying, Shall I go up to any of the cities of Judah? And the Lord said to him, Go up. David said, Where shall I go up? And he said, To Hebron. 2 Samuel 2 verse 1 to 4. Question 17. Where did Moses encounter the burning bush? A. Mount Sinai. B. Mount Nebo. C. Mount Horeb. D. Mount Moriah. The answer is C. Mount Horeb. Now Moses was tending the flock of Jethro his father-in-law, the priest of Midian. And he led the flock to the back of the desert and came to Horeb, the mountain of God. And the angel of the Lord appeared to him in a flame of fire from the midst of a bush. So he looked, and behold, the bush was burning with fire, but the bush was not consumed. Exodus 3 verse 1 to 6, question 18. In which city did Jesus perform his first miracle by turning water into wine? A. Capernaum. B. Nazareth. C. Bethsaida. D. Cana. The answer is D. Cana. On the third day, there was a wedding in Cana of Galilee, and the mother of Jesus was there. Now both Jesus and his disciples were invited to the wedding. And when they ran out of wine, the mother of Jesus said to him, They have no wine. John 2 verse 1 to 11. Question 19. Where did Jesus deliver the Sermon on the Mount? A. Mount of Olives. B. Mount Sinai. C. Mount Tabor. D. Mount Zion. The answer is A, Mount of Olives. And seeing the multitudes, he went up on a mountain, and when he was seated, his disciples came to him. Then he opened his mouth and taught them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Matthew 5 to 7, question 20. What is the city of Peter's origin? A, Bethsaida. P, Capernaum, C. Jerusalem, D. Nazareth. The answer is A. Bethsaida. Now Philip was from Bethsaida, the city of Enru and Peter. John 1 verse 44. Question 21. Where did Joseph and Mary flee to escape King Herod's persecution of infants? A. Babylon. P. Egypt. C. Assyria. D. Greece. The answer is B. Egypt. Now when they had departed, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream, saying, Arise, take the young child and his mother, flee to Egypt, and stay there until I bring you word. For Herod will seek the young child to destroy him. When he arose, he took the young child and his mother by night and departed for Egypt and was there until the death of Herod, that it might be fulfilled, which was spoken by the Lord through the prophet. 
saying, Out of Egypt I called my son. Matthew 2 verse 13 to 15, question 22. What river did Naaman bathe in to be healed of leprosy? A. Euphrates River. B. Nile River. C. Tigris River. D. Jordan River. The answer is D. Jordan River. Now Naaman, commander of the army of the king of Syria, was a great and honorable man in the eyes of his master, because by him the Lord had given victory to Syria. He was also a mighty man of valor, but a leper, and the Syrians had gone out on raids and had brought back captive a young girl from the land of Israel. 2 Kings 5 verse 1 to 14 Question 23 In which city did the Apostle Paul encounter a riot after preaching about Jesus? A. Athens B. Corinth C. Ephesus D. Thessalonica The answer is A. Athens now while Paul waited for them at Athens, his spirit was provoked within him when he saw that the city was given over to idols. Acts 17 verse 16 to 34. Question 24. Where did the Israelites wander for 40 years before entering the Promised Land? A. Wilderness of Sinai. B. Wilderness of Zen. C. Wilderness of Paran. D. Wilderness of Shur. The answer is A. Wilderness of Sinai. So the Lord's anger was aroused against Israel, and he made them wander in the wilderness forty years, until all the generation that had done evil in the sight of the Lord was gone. Numbers 32 verse 13. Question 25. What sea did Moses part to allow the Israelites to escape from the pursuing Egyptians? A. Red Sea. B. Dead Sea. C. Mediterranean Sea. D. Sea of Galilee. The answer is A. Red Sea. Then Moses stretched out his hand over the sea, and the Lord caused the sea to go back by a strong east wind all that night, and made the sea into dry land, and the waters were divided. So the children of Israel went into the midst of the sea on the dry ground, and the waters were a wall to them on their right hand and on their left. Exodus 14 verse 21 to 31. Question 26. Where did Jacob wrestle with God and have his name changed to Israel? A. Euphrates River. P. Jordan River. C. Chabok River. D. Nile River. The answer is C, Chabok River. And he arose that night and took his two wives, his two female servants, and his eleven sons, and crossed over the ford of Jabbok. He took them, sent them over the brook, and sent over what he had. Then Jacob was left alone, and a man wrestled with him until the breaking of day. Now when he saw that he did not prevail against him, he touched the socket of his hip. And the socket of Jacob's hip was out of joint as he wrestled with him. Genesis 32 verse 22 to 32. Question 27. In which city was the apostle Peter released from prison by an angel? A. Rome. B. Jerusalem. C. Antioch. D. Ephesus. The answer is B. Jerusalem. Peter was therefore kept in prison, but constant prayer was offered to God for him by the church. And when Herod was about to bring him out, that night Peter was sleeping, bound with two chains between two soldiers, and the guards before the door were keeping the prison. Now behold, an angel of the Lord stood by him, and a light shone in the prison, and he struck Peter on the side and raised him up, saying, Arise quickly, and his chains fell off his hands. 
Then the angel said to him, Gird yourself and tie on your sandals. And so he did. Acts 12 verse 1 to 19. Question 28. Where did Jesus deliver the Great Commission to his disciples before ascending to heaven? A. Galilee. P. Samaria. C. Jerusalem. D. Mount of Olives. The answer is D. Mount of Olives. And Jesus came and spoke to them, saying, All authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth. Go therefore and make disciples of all the nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all things that I have commanded you. And lo, I am with you always, even to the end of the age. Amen. Matthew 28 verse 16 to 20, question 29. What mountain did Elijah ascend into heaven on a chariot of fire? A. Mount Carmel B. Mount Tabor C. Mount Hermon D. Mount Sinai The answer is A. Mount Carmel. Then it happened, as they continued on and talked, that suddenly a chariot of fire appeared with horses of fire and separated the two of them. And Elijah went up by a whirlwind into heaven, and Elisha saw it, and he cried out, My father, my father, the chariot of Israel and its horsemen. So he saw him no more, and he took hold of his own clothes and tore them into two pieces. 2 Kings 2 verse 1 to 12 Question 30 Where did Paul write his letter to the Romans? A. Corinth B. Ephesus, seek Rome, D. Antioch. The answer is A. Corinth. For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God to salvation for everyone who believes, for the Jew first, and also for the Greek. For in it the righteousness of God is revealed from faith to faith, as it is written, the just shall live by faith. Acts 20, Romans 1. And that wraps up our Bible geography quiz. We hope you enjoyed testing your knowledge and learn something new along the way. Remember, the Bible is not just a book of stories, but also a map of history, guiding us through the lands where faith, courage, redemption, and the love of God unfolded. If you enjoyed this quiz, don't forget to leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe for more Bible content.